All right. To live action now in what has been a closely contested fight. One of those fights that somebody is still waiting to break through and be a difference maker in. Pulls the trigger right away with the left hand after getting tagged himself. Teddy, there are opportunities that are here for him, aren't there? Yeah, counter punch opportunities because he's got an opponent who's walking in a little bit. Now he has a chance to start to chuck something back at him a little. Come on, kid, focus. Left hand came after the jab. That's a solid right hand by Tommy Hearns. <laughs> Took a shot, now he gives a left. but he gave some back with the right hand. There's the combo downstairs. Tommy Hearns, oh, and a crushing hook just gets right to him. Teddy, what does he need to do right here? He has no balance. His legs aren't underneath him. Well, you know he can't move because he's going to fall on his own or the referee's going to stop it. So believe it or not, he's either got to grab or he's got to stand on a rope, stay right in front of the guy and move his head to make a miss. He can't use his legs. Well-placed, well-timed combo up top. Zap saw that punch coming. Judah was able to block it away. A little something for his opponent after getting tagged. Tommy Hearns is hit by a counter punch there. That's a forceful two punch combo by Judah. Double up your punch. Here's one for you now, he says, right back with the left hand. Lands flush with the combination upstairs. You see, Zab Judah is so lightning fast. That time, defense quickly turned into offense. Nice! Nice! Burns' corner knows the situation no here. Now, right? Yes, we're up in a close focus. fight. But anything can happen that can turn jab, things okay? around Double and go against jab, us. Just keep moving. You okay? Good. I need you to use your feet, all right? Move around and... All the eyes are on him to start this round. Judah's legs look just a little shaky, but keep in mind, he barely survived that last round. No, but keep one other thing in mind. I agree with you, Joe, but he's been here before. He's very experienced. If anyone knows how to get out of this, he does. Doubling up the jab by Judah. A solid left hand by Tommy Hearns. Well, there he is on the outside, staying away from any danger, but still able to do what he wants. Hey, Joe, so often we talk about the height, we talk about the length, but how about talking about patience? How about talking about discipline? He's using both those assets beautifully, staying on the outside, getting his kind of fight. And that's what fighters do. Pulls the trigger right away after taking one. Nowhere close that punch by Tommy Hearn.
where he wants to be able to do some damage with his opponent backed up against the ropes. Unable to land. Just in a big, big shot he just scored with. Oh, he doesn't look good. He just went down, and not the way he wanted it to go. Now, he's standing on the outside, Joe. He shouldn't be standing there. The old-timers would say, take a walk around the block. Stay away from the inside. Nice combination. Jab, uppercut to the head. Tommy Hearns is doing a good job of putting his punches together. His opponent's got to be wondering, how do I stop this? Well, right now, <laughs> you, you made a good point there because right now his opponent is wondering too much. You know, he's just busy blocking the punches, wondering about the combinations. He's not getting off. Takes one to give one. He comes back with a right hand. Zab Judah's movement's really helping him out, avoiding that punch. Hey, 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 go. And that does it for this round. This guy's never felt it before. Keep some pressure. All right, breathe. Good. Deep breath. Deep breath. Some water. You're good. You all right? You're okay, right? Teddy's scorecard through seven rounds. Hearns is up on Teddy's scorecard, but we know with what we've seen so far, this could change quickly. He's been hit. Yeah, he has a bad habit, and he's been hit for one reason. That bad habit of pulling back from punches. Every once in a while he does it, he gets away with it. But every once in a while he misjudges the distance, and he gets nailed. In and out. He's doing a really nice job here on the outside. He's staying safe. He is away from his opponent's danger zone. But yet he's able to accomplish things offensively. Yeah, he's getting full extension on his punches is what you're basically saying, Joe. He's doing a good job of that. If he threw his punches from a little too close, he would get time. So he's making sure he's at the right place when he first gets those punches moving. He digs in, trying to bank away body shots with the combo. He missed by a mile. That wasn't even close by Tommy Hearns. Good looking combo by Judah. Cut absolutely rocked him. Boy, I don't like the way his legs look at all right now. Big, big shot comes crashing home. Oh, Zab's in a tough spot right now. He's on the canvas again. Three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. And it's over. This fight is over. Judas smashed.